Item 127, missile suspension released. Item 128, launcher closure door open. Item 129, first stage ignition to missile. August 19th, airmen from Minot and Vandenberg Air Force Bases conducted an operational test launch of an unarmed Minuteman III missile. The test launch took place on the 45th anniversary of the first Air Force Minuteman III missiles, going on alert with the former 741st Strategic Missile Squadron at Minot. Today's test launch used an intercontinental ballistic missile pulled randomly from a silo on Minot, which was then transported and reassembled at Vandenberg and launched by crew members from the 91st Missile Wing at Minot. The ICBM was equipped with a test reentry vehicle and traveled approximately 4,200 miles to a test range near the Kwajalein Atoll in the Marshall Islands. ICBM test launches verify the accuracy and reliability of the weapon system, providing valuable data to ensure a safe, secure, and effective nuclear deterrent. Reporting from Vandenberg Air Force Base, I'm Senior Airman Shane Phipps. Today, airmen from Malmstrom and Vandenberg Air Force Bases conducted an operational test launch of an unarmed Minuteman III missile. The intercontinental ballistic missile was randomly pulled from a silo on Malmstrom and transported to Vandenberg before being launched more than 6,000 miles away to a test range near the island of Guam. This operational test launch provides valuable data for the ICBM program in addition to assuring the United States and allies of the Air Force's nuclear strike capabilities. Reporting from Vandenberg Air Force Base, I'm Tech Sergeant Curtis Villavicencio.